Y'all know I love helpful plants, but there's some that are problematic. Some will blister your skin and some will stop your heart. Today, we're gonna look at the dirty dozen. Castor bean, just one seed chew can be fatal. Ricin is no joke. Poison hemlock, purple stem and lacy flower. Looks like carrot, kills like cyanide. Water hemlock, one of the most toxic plants in North America. Poison ivy, you know the mnemonic. Leaves of three, stay away from me. Jensen weed, white trumpet flowers and a spiky pod. It's hallucinogenic and can be deadly. Deadly nightshade, beautiful blackberries, but just a few can kill a child. Bob parsnip, the sap plus sunlight on you can cause chemical burns. It's absolutely no joke. Pokeweed, the young leaves can be edible if, that's a big if, they are boiled just right. All the other parts of the plants can be toxic. Stinging nettle, definitely not going to kill you, but if you brush up against it, you're going to feel that burn on your legs and your arms instantly. Wild snake root, this plant killed Abraham Lincoln's mother when she drank it after cows had eaten it and it came through the milk. Virginia creeper, again, not as toxic as poison ivy, but the berries can be very toxic and some people get contact dermatitis from it as well. Carolina horse nail, pretty berries, painful thorns, and packed with poison. There's two things you need to do now. One, put in the comments below the things that I've missed. I'm sure there's some others out there. Number two, get in our online membership where we discuss and learn all sorts of information about plants. That way you can come get wild with me, Craig Cottle, and NRS Nation at Nature Blind School.